Last week, offensive performance was dreadful as the Buckeye offense protection broke down, allowing too many hits on the quarterback, forcing them to be tentative and cautious, never getting anything established. There were times where there was a complete breakdown up front, allowing for a record-setting nine sacks on the day and undue harassment on the quarterback position. Let's take a look at some plays that may give the Buckeyes a chance to have some success on offense. First up on the menu, the quick passing game. Running a three to five step passing game, also known as quick passes, requires an accurate quarterback that can fire the ball into tight spaces. It also takes the pressure off your offensive line when you play a physical, aggressive defense like the Black Shirts of Nebraska. Quick passes require a three step drop, minimizing the amount of pressure on the quarterback before the ball is gone. When executed frequently and properly, it can frustrate the entire defense because of the inability to create pressure up front and the pressure it put on the back end defenders. Next up on the menu, the pistol formation. This formation can put the defense at a disadvantage because of the twin receivers to the right while still having to honor the strong eye look. But this formation at play leaves the fullback wide open in the flat with plenty of room to rumble. The pistol is a hybrid of the shotgun and eye formation, allowing for a lot of flexibility to run or pass that will keep the defense guessing on how you're trying to attack. This play is successful because the quarterback is away from center and even with the unblocked defender, it allows the quarterback to lure in the blitz then drop off the pass opposite of that defender for a big game. Play action passes to the tight end side are the next ingredient for success for the Buckeyes. Playing the run and covering the tight end becomes difficult for even the most talented defenses. The defense is in a run 52 look with a cover 4. When the pass is diagnosed by the outside linebacker, he drops to the flat leaving an opportunity to strike downfield in between the cornerback and safety. With play action, cover four, and a vertical tight end, there's a small window downfield, but the pass must be thrown with accuracy and anticipation. Anticipation is one thing that is needed when inside the 20 yard line, as timing is ever more important when it's this close to the end zone. Execution is at a premium, as there is very little room for error. Because of the speed of the play, everyone must be on the same page. The success of this play begins first with the eye formation and trips to one side of the field, allowing the quarterback to choose the matchup that he wants to exploit. At the snap, the receiver appears to be covered, but with the anticipation of the quarterback, he is open and open for a big touchdown. That's what I call being inside the zone. 